Sukanya Krishnan, presenter of Sister Wives, is under pressure for her affection for Cody Brown. It has long been thought by many that she has been far too forgiving to the father of 18. She is essentially not posing meaningful or challenging questions. New viewers are currently attempting to make sense of all the animosity aimed at her, which seems to have opened up yet another bag of worms. Continue watching for further information. It was a huge disappointment to hear that Sakania Krishnan would be returning to present Sister Wives season 18 Tell All. Supporters felt that she was too forgiving of Cody Brown and did not hold him responsible for any of his inappropriate actions with his spouses or kids. They had no trouble expressing their emotions, but Sukanya only urged the audience to observe what transpired. She would then be willing to talk. Part 1 of the four-part Tell All seemed to have satisfied fans' appetites as they are unwilling to extend her tenure. Someone recently established a Reddit post to find out what Sukanya's detractors were saying. Seeing how poorly the host was doing at the tell-all, they watched as she was pushed down. They decided to check Twitter in response to this. Indeed, there is still the same contempt for the presenter on that forum, where many still believe that she gives Cody too much leeway. However, she appears to blame the audience for that. Yes, Suki says, they all admit a lot, but we viewers are just not paying attention to her. After asserting that they admit a lot, Suki was accused of supporting Cody Brown. What were the reactions of other Redditors to this? Some likened her to Howie Mandel during his interview with Tom Sandoval of Vanderpump Rules. Supporters said he shouldn't have done the sit-down as he had never watched the show. Moreover, Mandel consented to be lenient with Sandoval, which turned off a lot of people. Suki feels like she could interview Tom as Howie Mandel did after Scandoval. Exactly how I felt. Both knowledge and interest are required of the interviewer. As a fellow VPR enthusiast, I concur that she can prod without hurting anyone. Sakanyan Krishnan informed her followers via Twitter that she will be returning. Or that she has performed her duties sufficiently to get a second chance. Gypsy Traveling, I appreciate your feedback. I do believe that I should not be the judge or jury in this case involving Cody and Robin. It is a circumstance that you have all judged. It is, in my opinion, rather difficult. I enjoy each and every one of them. Fans who witnessed this thought. And the fact that they desire my return ought to say something. Yes, you don't confront him, which is why Cody likes you. Cody wants her to reveal everything, of course. Running straight over her, he does. She does not hold people responsible. It was also brought out that Suki mispronounces the name of Robin Brown, Cody Brown's remaining spouse. For fans, that meant she didn't know enough about the program to host a reunion or tell all. Sukanya so Krishnan's departure from Sister Wise is being demanded by fans who are furious with the season 18 tell-all presenter. They never wanted her back, so this is not a huge surprise. There could only be one conclusion to the news that the Sister Wives season was ending. The moment has come for the reveal. However, it was hoped that Sukanya so Krishnan would go and be replaced with a more assertive presenter. Many said that she did not truly hold Cody Brown responsible for any of his bad behavior and that she led him to get away with much too much. It seemed sense that some fans would not even want to watch after learning that she had been asked back. They went to every forum to voice their disgust over Krishnan's return. Sukanya's ignorance about one of Cody's marriages was brought to light by the original post on Reddit. Sukanya was said to have looked as though she had never seen the program before in the past. In addition, the original post stated this. She makes no effort to conceal the fact that she doesn't watch the program. We ought to be treated far better than this. I feel that every tell all that she has organized has been so meaningless and worthless. Other Redditors concurred and even found potential successors. Right now, it's just insane. The interviewer for the ET interview with Christine and Janelle was someone I truly loved. She clearly has been along for the entire journey. At last, I discovered her name, Deirdre Bihar. Andy Komen is necessary. For a few years, they had NBC hosts, and I adored them. Andrea Canning and Tamron Hall. However, things have become so terrible that Sukanya Krishnan's removal has been petitioned for permanently. The whole process involved finding a new host for upcoming tell-alls, and it was completed via change.org. Aiming for 500 signatures, they have about 300 as of right now. Supporters expressed their strong opinions regarding Sukanya Krishnan's removal in a very detailed petition. They felt that further footage exposing his falsehoods were necessary. Furthermore, Sukanya was the wrong person to choose for this, his feet have to be kept close to the flames. 
The claim that she is only carrying out her duties because she is constrained by the sister wise production has been made, but the audience is not buying it. She would prefer that everyone watch every segment before making a choice, but it appears that decisions have already been made. The cast of Sister Wives One on One is being questioned about their lies by presenter Sukanya Krishnan, but she is coming under fire for not holding Cody responsible. Even though Sister Wives season 18 is almost over, there are still a few segments of Sukanya Krishnan's Tell All One on One episodes left, and viewers are criticizing the presenter for not holding Cody responsible for his deeds. Cody struggled with each of his wives during season 18 of Sister Wives. Cody was still married to Janelle Brown, Mary Brown, and Robin Brown at the start of Sister Wives season 17, despite Christine Brown leaving him at the conclusion of the show. With Robin as his lone supporter, Cody's marriages fell apart due to problems with each of his spouses. Though many were surprised that Sukanya, or Suki, didn't confront him for his actions, it was expected that she would discuss these and other topics on Sister Wives one-on-one. -on -one. The presenter was supposed to let him get away with murder again, according to an Instagram remark made on a sneak peek of the first tell-all show, according to ET Online. She will just let him to speak whatever garbage he wants. Say everything. Don't say anything. Honestly, I believe you are hearing more than you have ever heard. Suki said in response to the criticism. I make an effort to be just. In the first episode of Sister Wives, one-on-one, -on -one, Cody did come clean about some of his transgressions, but only under his own conditions. Despite being repeatedly called out, even by his own family, the patriarch of the failing Brown family rarely speaks about his most heinous deeds until he feels compelled to do so or sees a benefit to sharing his regrets. Even though Cody claims he's matured and learned from his errors, he still feels that going his own way is the best course of action and has never really strayed from it. In the more recent seasons of Sister Wives in particular, Cody has always been hard to grasp. While the media has long discussed his problematic conduct, his relationships with Christine, Janelle, and Mary have been under more scrutiny in recent years. Though people anticipate that Cody will be held responsible for his actions, this is rarely the case when he appears on Sister Wives or in the Tell All episodes. Despite being questioned about his behavior, Cody is always given the opportunity to reply or provide an explanation and is never chastised for his mistakes. Even though there are still three tell-all episode parts to come, if the first one is any guide, Cody will probably get away with it once more without having to answer for his behavior. It's fascinating that presenter Supi choose to be less critical of Cody than she is of his wives, even though she must be fair to everyone involved. It may be tough to see someone like Cody continue to get away with so much harm without being held accountable, even while the sister wives one-on-one -on -one episodes Maybe a breath of new air when it comes to the cast voicing issues. Is it now time for sister wives Christine Brown and Janelle Brown to have their own spin off series? They have been getting closer since splitting from Cody Brown. Wives of sisters, after deciding to part ways with Cody Brown, Christine and Janelle Brown discussed their ideas for a spin off series of their own, which fans have been clamoring for. Janelle has had less time to herself outside of her marriage, but Christine, who left Cody during Sister Wives season 17, has had more time to collect her views before sharing with the world. Even though they both left their spiritual marriages with Cody, the two have been sister wives for more than 30 years and still see themselves as a family. Janelle is a part of Christine and her new husband, David Woolley's future plans. While there aren't any formal plans for a spin-off series following Sister Wives season 18, Christine and Janelle said in an interview with Entertainment Tonight that they'd both be open to talking about it. Janelle verified that no discussions are now taking place regarding a spin-off starring the two of them. But Christine said, We have conversations, we have had conversations. The Sister Wives stars made it apparent that they presently had no plans to quit the original series, even though they were intrigued by the prospect of having their own program. Rather, Janelle said, We do have a lot of fun, and we will always continue to. We have a lot of exciting things planned for next year, which we are currently planning for. The couple talked about how they intend to continue having a good time together and that they have some exciting plans for the future year. Christine and Janelle have a link that doesn't appear to be broken after cohabiting in many marriages together. The choice of Christine and Janelle to terminate their marriages was not influenced by the program itself. Although Christine stated that she believes the fans should know that my marriage is ending because we've been authentic and real for all of these years. Her marriage to Janelle terminated, but their relationship remained strong. 
We had a good multiple marriage, in my opinion, because of our relationship and closeness with Janelle. We remain sisters' wives and a family that raises its children together. While Christine may not have always got along with her sister wives, the closeness that she enjoys with Janelle has been encouraging to observe. Christine married into the Brown family in 1994, just a few years after Janelle. Following the intense altercation between Janelle and Cody in Sister Wives, Season 18, Episode 3, Christine provided Janelle with support when she made the painful choice to end her marriage. After raising their kids together and growing up in the same family for many years, the ladies are now starting new chapters in their life together. They were able to rely on one another during an extremely trying period. It's feasible that Christine and Janelle will stay on Sister Wives for some time to continue discovering who they are independent of the constraints of multiple marriages as they enter their next stage of life. Although all of their children have grown up, Christine and Janelle have recently focused more of their time on traveling and spending time with Christine's husband, David. Even though Sister Wives is currently enjoying its highest level of popularity, the two may not be prepared for their own spin-off series, but there is still hope for a successful future.